What's going on everybody? CJC presents one of the workouts in anime and we are here. DLC pack 5 is out. Special log. Check it out. I haven't touched it yet as you can see by the star. Kobe's Combat Chronicle. But we're gonna go ahead. Today we're gonna showcase Shanks doing the old emperor. So we're going to fight against Big Mom and Kaido. And here they are. Uta. Film Red Shanks. Kobe. And his costume, which is just regular marine Kobe. So, it's fine, is what it is. But, we're gonna go ahead and get started. And I'm so excited to showcase Film Red Shanks. This is, oh, oops, wrong button. I, oh, okay, so the quote is, I think, U U Uta's uh, my daughter, basically. So yeah, I figured this would be a good mission to start out going up against the old Yonko. And let's take a look at the new soul map. And we're going to scout the new skills here. So Soul Seeker, this is such a good skill. Such a good skill. Because as you can tell, like, I you know, I really haven't map, um, maxed out anything. But Soul... Like, so... I haven't maxed out everything. So the fact that Soul Seeker is here, it's a great skill to have, 100%. Gotta have that. Let's see what else they have here. Uh, not these. Not this one. Uh, okay. Some new upgrades. That's cool. Top of the world. Ooh, this for sky types is incredible. Incredible for sky types. Nice. I really like this skill. Very impressed. A lot of stuff you can do. Um... The air combos are going to be great. Guts. Um. Okay. So I. Huh. Okay. I don't know how to feel about this necessarily. Um. I don't think I'll ever use this skill. If I'm just being honest. Um. It's it's cool to have. I would have liked for something else. Um. But it's good to know if you die. I guess I'm assuming that's how the skill is. You pass away, or not pass away. You die, and then you know you get that little bit of life. Coin Muncher, again, I don't think I'll ever use this, um, unless I don't have any characters I want to max out. Maybe I'll use Coin Muncher. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm not sure about that. Iron Wall, oh! Your Yonko characters are going to be insane. If you think uh, Kaido and Hybrid Kaido is, you know, unbreakable now, you, as playing as them, you're going to feel like the true King of the Beasts. Yeah, I think pretty sure that was his moniker. But yeah, Soul Seeker, that's probably the best skill. Um, like I said, like I haven't even maxed out the other uh, soul maps. So probably off screen, I'll do a little bit of grinding before I start the next gameplay. Um, but this is everything. Again, just Iron Wall. That's a really good skill. Top of the world, which is great for sky type characters um, to keep looping in the air. Guts, this is okay. Um, I don't think I'll ever use this, if I'm just being honest. But it's there. Uh, coin Muncher, um, again, this is cool. Um, if I max out my coins and I don't have any other character I want to level up. But I don't know how you know good it will be regarding um, the cheat death skill. So it's not going to work well, personally speaking. But Soul Seeker and Iron Wall, best new skills. 110 percent very happy about the other skills that got upgrades um but soul seeker iron wall best new skills by far okay um so i am going ahead and grind out and i will see you after the grind all right just finish this up um let's take a look at the special moves get serious rebel that might be a new move Power Wave, uh, that was regular Shanks anyway. Um, definitely gotta try out the new Congress Hoggy. There's no way we don't. And Power Wave, do I want to try something else? Get Serious Revival sounds really cool. I don't think that was in the initial. So Soren Griffin, that's the the one he uses in Film Red. Um, do I want that? Yeah, let's go Power Wave, alright. So, yeah, th this is my skills. Um, just to be sure, just to show you guys where I'm at. I did rank all of it. 
um, maxed him out to where I was at that point. I'm um, going to use my skills. I think I'm okay with these. Not sure. But now I'm going to give Shanks um, some supporting skills and I'll show you at the end. Alright, so we have full force. As you can see, this is what I have here. Um, this is what a lot of attack power, a lot of fist. I'm going to do a lot of fisting today. Pause. Sovereign strength, of course, this has to be in his uh, skill set. Um, I feel good with this. So let's, let's start up. I'm excited. Let's go. And very fitting that we are in Wano. <gasps> okay, this is his taunt. The hockey walk is his taunt. I thought it was going to be the triangle attack. Oh, this is so sick. I love when they do such unique taunts. And this is definitely one of them, 100%. I love this. I am just spamming this. This is so sick. Shanks knows he's a bad bitch. Look at him. The way he's walking. He know he a 10. Okay. Whoa. He does like two conquer hockey waves in his base combo. Oh my god. That is disgusting. That is so nasty. Okay, I am a little hockey walk. I'm gonna act like a bad bitch here. Okay, so I definitely think uh, I should have equipped Tenacity for sure. Definitely feel like I'm being a little knocked back a little too much. Oh my god, teleportation? Yo, Shanks is sick. I love this. Okay, so that smash attack I just did, that is the triangle. Oh my goodness, I'm loving it. Yeah, I definitely need some tenacity for sure, because holy crap. Let me see the Congress hockey wave. That is a big wave. Um, I forget who I was talking to about this in the comment section. It might have been Asher, I'm not too sure. Um, I'm loving how Shanks plays. This is incredible. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, um, I don't know if that's bigger than the regular Congress hockey wave. It looks the same to me, if I'm just being honest. Um, but seeing it in combo versus, you know, the ultimate move, I, I can definitely see it. Because he does the, the new Conqueror's Hockey Wave in combo, right here. It's disgusting. Okay, so you, you have to do the full combo. I forget that speed types, you need to do like seven hits for, for a square combo. Um, so we're going to go ahead and fight Big Mom first. And then we're going to fight Kaido. But yeah, I am loving this. I mean, this is incredible. Oh, and he teleports after... Whoa! Okay, so... Oh my goodness. So in the um, the character bio on the website... Oh, look at this lighting. Holy crap. I'm getting so sidetracked because I am so excited to play this game. Okay, let's show Big Mom our hockey. That took out a big chunk of her damage. And this is one of the harder missions, too. That was a big chunk of damage. I, I just wish they showed or they gave us more missions outside of, um, you know, the special logs. But I, again, I think it's with the coding of the game that it, it wasn't able to do so. We're all just putting the beats. Myself in the AI. Holy crap. Definitely not fair that I have a, a Kainu on the team. <laughs> I like that's what he says to a, a fellow Yonko, or not fellow anymore. He's like, yeah, you rely too much on your devil for the Which is kind of true. I mean, you know, she didn't really use Conqueror's Hockey that much uh, in Wano anyway, or the Onigashima battle. If she did that, I mean, I'm sure. Th you know, long kid would have lost way earlier. But, uh, you know, I digress. So now we're gonna take her on when she's, uh, riding a cloud. But yeah, as I was saying before, if you finish a complete X combo, which, again, I think it's like seven hits for Shanks, um, if there's still enemies, he'll just teleport to the enemy, which is incredible. Whoa! What the fuck? A base combo breaks guard? There's no way. 
There's no way I just saw that. Alright, let me do some Hawkers hockey on your bitch ass. Big mom. There's no way I just saw that. Right now I'm just playing with the combos. Oh, kids here. That's fitting. That's fitting. Kids here? Okay. I'm taking care of you after Big Mom. Yes, I am. I don't typically do this on missions as much, but, you know. For a kid? Yeah, bro. You're getting sauced. Oh my god, guys. Base combo breaks guard. Base combo breaks guard. Are you kidding me? Oh, there's so many people here right now. Take a look at my eyes. Bitch. Yeah, I am loving this game. I mean, this is... This has been incredible. Oh my god. Filmer Chanks is dirty. He should have been a speed sight freaking base game. <laughs> this is incredible. I, if I have to compare the two, I really like how this Shanks plays. I really do. Base combo, you know, picks cart. This is... I don't know how many characters do that outside of giant characters. That their base combo breaks guard. That is... Look at that. That broke her guard. I'm sorry I'm not giving the most insightful gameplay, but I am just so fascinated that... He breaks guard base combo. As a small character, you, like not a giant, not white beard, not big mom, right? Not hybrid or base Kaido. Um, base for me, let me just go away, because that bomb, the Prometheus thing, always fucking work. Oh my god. This is insane. And then the sword thing? Oh, Yeah, no, I'm... Hands-on impressions, and again, this might be um, very recency bias. I definitely think this Shanks is better than this Shanks. Um, he's probably the best speed type, if I'm just being honest. I know Ace packs a punch for speed type, but with... Yeah, look at that. That just broke guard. Base combo, guys. Broke guard. Stop it. It's, it's between him and Hybrid Kaido right now. Uh, I think top three speed character in the game. Um, you can go either or. Hybrid, Sh um, hybrid Shanks. Hybrid Kaido, Filmred Shanks, or Ace as the best speed types. Yeah. Damn, Big Mom. Hello. No, I'm kidding. Um, I should I probably should have grabbed the meat thing just because of the um, the cheat death skill I have equipped. But let's go fuck up, kid. Let's make it canon here. Now, a lot of people were saying this is um, divine departure. I don't think it is at all. I think this is just a regular slash because this is the quote that he says to Green Bull. So I don't think we would know that Shanks has divine departure. And look at the full force burst. I love it. That might be a thumbnail. And look how fast, dude. Base combo breaks guard. I mean, if that's not insane, then I don't know what is. Yamante, no chance. Kid, of course, no chance. Um, yeah, as I was saying, uh, I don't think they would give him Divine Departure, just because I believe that character past two characters were in development um, once Film Red came out in Japan. Or at least, at least, um, as re oh, I'm sorry, as recent as Luffy versus Luchi in the Egghead arc. So it was minor spoilers, but I mean they do show it in the new opening for the anime. Um, once they do fight, because of Gear Five, Luffy's uh, one of his moves. I'm just gonna fight Katakuri because he was also in Film Red. Just get them hands real quick. Oh my god, that was disgusting. Whatever I, whatever the hell I just did, that was nasty. Holy shit, it just breaks. <sighs> Guys, I know I'm so dumbfounded by this, but there aren't that many characters, base combo, that break guard so easily. I mean, there really isn't. Um, I'm trying to think who else. Guys, let me know in the comment section below, because I, I don't know who else base combo breaks guard this easy. 
Also, while we're here just kicking ass in the meantime, um, we're going to make our way to Kaido, of course. But I do want to mention that I have an upload schedule. So if you want to know when I'm doing, you know, what videos are coming out next, you can check that out in my community post. Um, or I'm going to put it up on the screen here. Um, just check that out. Um, there are no... Holy shit, why is there so many people here? Relax. Relax, guys. Jeez. <laughs> um, yeah, so I do have an upload schedule. Um, so, next video is going to be Uta. Then we have Kobe. And then I do want to thank you guys for 2023. Um, I should have made the video a lot sooner. Um, just, you know, personal life. Um, and then we're going to do the episode log for... Um, Kobe's Combat Challenge, or whatever it's called, Kobe's Combat Tour. I really would have thought it was going to be Uta's World Tour. I really thought it was. Um, but obviously it was not. So it's interesting. So I don't think a character that's led the DLC pack has a. Um, the character story. I think it's always the third character. So I'm curious. What's up, Kaido? Michu ma Michu ma Haki. Um, I am curious who whose story is going to um, be told, I guess, in the final DLC. Or at least DLC 6. I don't, we don't know if we're doing this ever again. I just love the oh, so much damage. Um, because so since I predicted that the special log for DLC pack six would be Roger, he would take the lead. Um, obviously, ev evidence from the last two DLC packs, including this one, has shown us that is not the case, and it's typically the third character. So for all we know, um, it's either going to be between Rayleigh or um, Garth, whose story that they revolve around. We'll see. Yeah, I, this this attack is insane. Oh my goodness. I am loving this. Shanks is good, man. Shanks is really good. This is a... I think this is a great showcase. I think this is a great character. Love the hockey walk. He a bad bitch. He know he a 10. The way he fucking flipping his hair. <laughs> but yeah, uh, for those of you who have played Shanks so far, what do you think? Where would you put him on your tier list? Um, and do you guys want to see a tier list? This is just such a good move. Yeah, so let me know. You know what's interesting? I'm actually just noticing this. That this Shanks, and maybe it's a bug? Or it was a bug with Oh, look at that. That was disgusting. Beige stands no chance. Oh. Um, anyway, as I was saying, I noticed that with um, the Conqueror's Hockey Wave, you don't put your blade. So base Shanks, if he and I did a video on this most recently, you can check that out. Um, his base form, if you do Conqueror's Hockey, it coats your blade automatically. But this, in this case, um, Film Red Shanks does not do that. I mean, it's not that big of a deal because honestly, you're hitting so fast. And pause when I say this, but you're hitting so hard. Damn, Hawkins. Don't pay shit on my face. Holy shit. Alright, I mean, let's go find Kaido now. Uh, actually, no. Let me hit you with a power. Beat. I realize I don't use my supers as often as I should, although I, ha <laughs> I have been spamming it often. Conjures, huh? But it's just, this character is so much fun. Look at this. Oh. Definitely one of the best characters in this game. Yeah, if you guys want to see a tier list, please let me know. I will drop a tier list. Once I've played everyone, of course. There he is. There's Kaido, and I'm pointing my sword right at you, my boy. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Oh my goodness. This is just dirt. 
Let me show you what's up, Kaido. Yeah, th I mean, this... This is gonna be such a good time for one piece and I think 2024 we're gonna be eating 100% Oh man, the freaking the sword move. Oh jeez. Oh crap. That kind of is kicking his ass. I want to do the sword thing. I think that was a kind of yeah. That was definitely a kind of who got the hit. Wow. But all right, everybody. That will take us to the end of today's video. Look at Shanks. We caught the dub. Easy S rank. Thank you so much for watching. Please stay tuned. Next video is going to be on Uta. First hands-on impression. Um, see you in the comment section below. And of course, I will see you in the next video. Peace.